Well, that didn't go as planned. <laughs> Had to say that. Before I get into that, let me quickly share Romans 8, 28. And we know that God causes everything to work together for good for those who love God and are called according to his purpose. Remember back in the Old Testament, while in prison, Joseph correctly interpreted dreams for two of Pharaoh's imprisoned servants. And then two years later, Pharaoh had two dreams that disturbed him, but no one can tell him what they meant. Well, the cupbearer remembered Joseph and told Pharaoh about him. Pharaoh, in turn, immediately sent for Joseph. And with God's help, Joseph told him what the dreams meant. Now, Joseph was immediately released from prison to become Pharaoh's top official and took charge of the preparation. Joseph had trusted God through many years of hardship, and God worked all those painful circumstances for good. Good for Joseph personally. Good for Joseph Jacob's family. Good for his chosen people in the generations to come. They would grow in Egypt from a few to millions. Think about this. God's plan is always good. Now, you may have suffered rejection. You may have experienced disappointment or maybe even hardship. Or you may have recently entered into a time of difficulty in your life. Hold on to Romans 8.28. That no matter what has happened or what is happening, no matter what's going to happen in the future, no matter what's to come, what you're going through, what's in the past, trust in God. Because when you trust in God and trust God, He can and He will bring good from what you're going through. And remember, He loves you. Now, you may not understand your circumstances or what's going on in your life right now. You may not see how any good could possibly come from what's happening to you right now. But like Joseph, if you will keep your eyes on God and trust Him, good will come. Again, don't forget Romans 8.28 and don't forget that God loves you, no matter where you are and what's going on in your life. This has been Coffee with Carney. Have a great day.